The human trial is a measured but unmistakable advance in stem cell research that advocates say could well usher in a new era in medicine. The spinal cord treatment has been under development by the California-based Geron Corporation for nearly a decade. Thomas O'Karma is the company's president and CEO. This is the world's first attempt to use embryonic stem cells in people. Unlike human stem cells derived from blood or fat, researchers covet the cells that are derived from human embryos that were fertilized in vitro and considered surplus. Scientists say theoretically embryonic stem cells can grow into any kind of cell in the body and could be used to replace or regenerate cells damaged by disease or injury. Okarma says Geron has already successfully treated rats for spinal cord injury. We take the animal under anesthesia and we open up the spinal cord and we give the animal a very precise uh, damage to the cord that resembles the damage in an automobile accident. Then within two weeks of the injury, we inject the human cells that we make from embryonic stem cells. And after several weeks, we see dramatic and sustained improvement in the animal's locomotion, its body control, its paw placement. Um, and that improvement is permanent. By the middle of this year, eight to 10 people with severe spinal cord injuries will be eligible for injections. They will receive the specialized nerve cells that enable electrical signals to travel between the brain and the rest of the body. As a phase one trial, the study using people will primarily assess the safety of the treatment. Stem cell researcher Arnold Kriegstein from the University of California, San Francisco says there's a risk to rushing too quickly into therapy. The public has to be patient because science is, is unpredictable and it usually takes a lot longer than most of us would like. Stem cells have been at the heart of a long time political dispute. I have concluded that we should allow federal funds to be used. To In 2001, then President Bush limited federal funding for stem cell research to the pre-existing lines of human embryonic cells. We will restore science to its rightful place. President Obama and Democratic leaders in Congress have pledged to reverse the restrictions. The experimental spinal treatment comes from an existing line of cells, but the company heralds the trial as the beginning of a new chapter in human healing. Rachel Silverman in San Francisco for VOA News.